it's just crazy to think that we made it this far from last year coming from only having four stars coming back. We did have two losses versus Q and D, and I think now we're redeeming ourselves, getting to the Final Four. It's awesome. You build a program, and it started 12 years ago with Eric Stratton and I coming back, and it's been a build-up. We've been to the Sweet 16, we've been to the Final Eight before, but the next step was the hardest part. And this group of kids, in my mind, when we sat down here last year when we lost against Gale, or against Edwardsville, I think it was just a point of. They've got the capability, but were they willing to do it? And over that journey of a time since last October when we sat here to where we are now in November, it's a proven fact to any coach and any team out there. If your kids put your mind to it and they believe in what they're doing, good things can become of it. Including a state title. And coming off a stellar 40-minute finish to Tuesday's Super Sectional, the Blue Devils enter their final two matches of the year brimming with confidence and momentum. I honestly believe if we all play as a team and just click as we did the last 40 minutes, we will have a great chance. I mean, we've only let in two goals in the past all postseason, so, I mean, it's doing good. You're in the final 16, you're playing good teams. You can get to final eight, there's no weak point. We get to final four, you're going to have to have your best game that you can put together. And if we can put together two games like we did down in St. Louis, the last two games against Cherry Creek and Washburn Rural, I think we'll be competitive. If we decide to not play at that, that level, we're going to find ourselves coming from behind and, and battling our own selves. We, we know we've got a tough road, but you know what? We're one of the four top teams in Class 3A, and it's been a goal for these kids, and we're there, and we're, we're not going to disappoint a lot of people.